I was finally like, this is now or never. And look, I was always there. Everywhere I traveled around the world, they wanted a sequel. And it was just never right. It's just the story wasn't right. But I'd lay there in bed, and I, I'm constantly thinking about stories. And I was like, okay, what if? How? And I was waiting for technology to be able to catch up to some of the things that I wanted to accomplish. Because in the first one, I flew in the F-14. We had a camera that had five minutes of film, and I would turn it on and off. And I waited to see where... You know, and I did American Made. And when I was doing American Made, the aerials, it was always in the back of my mind that if I did Top Gun, what about this? And and then we did, McHugh and I did Fallout together, and we were developing those cameras for the helicopters and that aerial sequence. It was all a progression to where we're, where we're going. And Kaczynski, when I was doing Oblivion with Joe, he's like, I always talked about Top Gun. I said, Joe, let's just, let's make Oblivion right now, you know? And then I was shooting Fallout, and McHugh was talking to me about Top Gun for, you know, 10 years. And it just came together. And it just was like, okay, it is now or never. And I felt like the challenge is there and maybe we can figure this out. My whole life, since I was four, I wanted to make movies. And I remember being on the set of Taps and thinking, you know, if I can make movies the rest of my life, I'd be so happy. So it's kind of amazing. It's surreal. It's I don't know, it's surreal that here we are and I'm, I'm doing this and it's surreal that it's Top Gun Maverick. 36 years, I'll hold that for you, I got it. I got you, I got you. <laughs> okay, 36 years later and here we are. It's surreal, I'm just, I'm just no, nothing else to say. Like, not only is training, but just structurally, the making the movie coming up you know, in, in every way that's technically challenging, it's emotionally, you know, how, do you, how do you create a story like this and constantly find the tone um, throughout it was it was challenging on every I have to say on every single level so to hear the audience's response and it's really very special